looking up north from Cooktown. This is the bay where Captain Cook came in and I think I just fell in love with Cooktown. So here's the man, Captain James Cook. Captain Cook, it says here, he left nothing unattempted. Cook wasn't very old at all, he was an old man. And not only did young people come out on the moon, young people explored the world. This can marks the spot where Captain James Cook reached his bark HMS Endeavour on the 18th of June in the year 1770. The footprints of the native people. So this is the Aboriginal mural, which is to balance Cook's arrival. I think this is the Aboriginal story actually of Cook's arrival. That he arrived and it was their land. Yeah. Mm. Well, here's, his, well, here's the ship here. Oh, okay. And just here where the monument is, is a cultural walk and it tells you all about the history of the town. 1606 sightings and landings. The Spanish explorer Quiros claimed for his king, all the lands which I sighted and am going to sight shall be called Astrales del Espirito Santo. That was actually 150 was years before year. Cook that even arrived. It has a big hardware, it, got, it has four or five caravan parks and you can do free camping at the race course. And there's a beautiful track to walk or ride into town from the race course. This is the spot where Sir Joseph Banks first saw a kangaroo. They climbed up this hill and they saw the kangaroo. They called it the beast. So they came all the way up the east coast and they hadn't yet seen a kangaroo. So this is where they, they saw it. Fish and chips. 